hello once again. Um, this is a collective haul. So I purchased some items from different stores. I went to my local thrift store called Savers and I found these beautiful, I believe they're, um, I'm not sure, I think they're Blue Willow. These beautiful teacups. And their matching saucer. Really beautiful. So I found about four of them, and they actually came in this basket here. They were asking $7.99 for it, but I received a 30% off coupon, so I believe it came up to $5.20, I'm not sure. So I was really happy for that. And here's another example of shopping off-season. I found these beautiful ornaments see there really beautiful it has glitter um it kind of looks like mercury glass um it's two ornaments two glass ornaments and i paid 2.99 for it um, I don't know how much the original price is, but when I saw these, I was like, yes, please. <laughs> really beautiful. So I found two. So that's what I purchased from my local thrift store. The next store that I went to was Walmart. I actually go to Walmart do my food my grocery shopping so I saw this and I was like oh this is so cute it's actually going to match it's gonna go well with this little duck that I purchased from my local thrift store and I paid four dollars and 48 cents for it if you want to see the duck that I purchased, um, I actually have it on my previous haul, and I'll leave the link below. Next item. This is this really pretty necklace. I don't know if you can see the detail. really nice it has like little beads and I guess it was originally five dollars and I paid three dollars for it from Walmart this is really pretty I mean the necklaces that I purchased from Walmart when I put them on everyone <laughs> I get compliments all the time people want to know where what where I purchased it from and I, I would tell them I purchased from Walmart Next item, this Rust-Oleum spray paint. I got this green color here. I'm actually going to use it for my spring and Easter tablescape. So look out for that. So I'm trying this new format. You know, I'm sitting on my couch and talking, sipping my coffee here. Um, if you like this format, leave me a thumbs up. Let's see here. Um, I believe that's about it for Walmart. Next place, the Dollar Tree. Found this really cute 
I guess it's some type of thing you stick in the ground. And I thought it was so adorable. When I saw it, I thought, wow, I can definitely use this for my daughter's Easter wreath that I'll have hanging. I usually hang at her um, bedroom door. So um, I don't really need the stick part. I'll probably cut off the stick part and use the muddy. It's so cute. So I got that. Next, I got another bouquet of daffodils. Really nice. And then I purchased these beautiful, I believe I purchased about three bunches of this crocus. So pretty. The colors are really beautiful. It's like this coral color and this, I don't know, this pinkish peaches, peach color. I thought it was really pretty. I'm going to be using that for my um, Easter spring tablescape, so look out for that. I know I said that already. Next, I purchased these potted lavender here. So I purchased three. Um, this year, I was thinking about what I wanted to do for my spring wreath, and I figured, hey, why not do a potted plant wreath? I don't know if I'm going to do a tutorial on it. If you're interested in seeing a tutorial, please leave a comment below. But I bought these for that reason. And I also purchased these clay pots. They come in three for a dollar for my wreath. Next, I purchased some books. Um, they're not really for reading. They're for um, decorative purposes only. I just purchased them because I was looking at the color of the the color and I thought this is perfect for the color scheme that I'm going for. So I'll take off the covers now. This one I'm just gonna stack them up together, stack them up. And the bigger one is the white one. It's all white. So, it's just going to stack them like this. Really pretty. I like it. And maybe put some type of accessory on top. So, that's the reason why I purchased these books. The colors. Well, that concludes my haul. I hope you enjoyed the video. And once again, thank you to all my subscribers, new, old. Thank you for your support. I'm trying something different for my channel. I actually want to, um, you know, edit it and make it look more professional. So if you enjoyed this video, Leave me a thumbs up. If you have any comments, please leave them below. And thank you for watching. This is Joanne Charles of Island Girl Lifestyle. Bye. Hello, everyone. This is Joanne Charles of Island Girl Lifestyle. And I wanted to show you this beautiful DIY that I made. This is a full succulent wall art I have here on my entryway.
I actually have the tutorial. So if you're interested in finding out how I made it, the link will be below.